Hey, what's going on guys? So a couple weeks ago, I did an awesome video on some signs that one of my neighbors got that were all custom made by a guy named The Retro Beard. Uh, once again, I'm gonna put his information in the description below. But as I alluded to in that video, uh, which was great by the way, I mean, his signs are so high quality, so fantastic. Um, I mean, I just love them. Uh, so obviously I wanted to get one for myself. And like I said, as I was alluding to in that video, I was working with him to get a custom sign made for myself. Um, there were some hiccups along the way. Uh, not anything that, that either of us foresaw, but what I wanted was bigger than he had originally the capacity to do. Uh, originally he was uh, had some constraints that basically did not fit with the design I had in my mind. That said, uh, he ended up getting some new parts and some new modifications for his equipment that enabled him to make exactly what I wanted and oh my god this is like the coolest thing ever um, in fact so cool and so big that we are not going to be able to use my normal unboxing area I'm gonna have to go out into the game room and, and film something different but I want to show off the sign that he made me and uh, so without further ado let's get into unboxing this masterpiece so, as I stated, this is a massive sign. Uh, uh, the stuff he usually does, uh, usually had like a 20 inch in one direction um, kind of threshold and then I think like 14 in the other, but now he's able to go way bigger. So I actually got it in two packages here. Um, pretty sure that this one is the accessories and power supply. So let's get into that first, just to verify my thoughts Boop. it's Christmas and I'm a savage all right yep exactly what I thought so it is a remote the mounting brackets Some cleaner, a dope sticker, <laughs> a dope pin that's going on the pin board, the mounting brackets which look really nice, very nice, very high quality, and the remote and the power. Alright, so I'll move all this aside for now and get into the sign. Okay. Oh. All right. Mm, moment of truth. There it is. <laughs> so, for those of you who know or don't know, you're about to know, in the 90s, Sega had the really crazy marketing sign, uh, kind of a marketing concept, where they had this logo that just said, welcome to the next level, and each word uh, kind of lapped over to the next line, and they were all different colors, and I always thought that looked freaking cool. Said he was going to be right back. He was normally a very quiet boy. And I would love to have that for a sign idea. And that is what I got. Oh my word. Um. This thing is hype as hell. This is sick. I So it's two parts because you have the spacers to hold them apart from each other. 
um, and then the LED lights. So I'm going to now build the sign before mounting it, of course. I'm going to build it and see what this bad boy looks like all lit up. So here is the sign, and here is the sign powered up. Oh man, it looks so friggin' sick. Oh my god. Alright, uh, I actually want to see it with the lights off. So let's do one more, uh, one more shot with the lights off. Okay, this is friggin' cool. Are you ready? Let's go. Oof, welcome to the next level. This is gonna be awesome. And now I'd love to show you guys where in my game room it's going. And there we go. First thing you see when you get in the game room is gonna be the welcome to the next level sign. I'm obviously gonna move that poster up a little bit, maybe mount it to the wall. Um, but regardless, man, this thing is fantastic. I did not, not think it was gonna turn out as good as it did. It is beautiful work of art. Uh, once again, the quality is amazing, and I am so glad I got to uh, work with the Retro Beard and get this sign in my game room. So that turned out 1,000 times better than I could have ever, ever, ever expected. Um, my God, you know, when I saw the signs that my neighbor got when I did that video, I was like already like, oh man, these are so cool. I gotta get something like this. But uh, you know, after getting this custom built for myself, and the price was very reasonable. Um, highly, highly recommended, uh, obviously. And the quality speaks for itself. I said that like a thousand times in the last video. And now that I have something for my game room, really the crown jewel when you walk into my game room. I mean, it's like the first thing you're gonna see. Uh, man, so thank you so much. Thank you so much, uh, The Retro Beard, for making this for me. It is phenomenal, it is beautiful, it is amazing, it is everything I wanted and more. Um, you guys, if you're interested in anything like this, reach out to him. Uh, he has a bunch of stuff that's already, you know, kind of pre-done, uh, you know, ideas. But he obviously will make custom signs, even if it happens to be very obscure advertising from the 90s. Uh, man, this man will do it. As long as you send him some kind of design, he will work through it. Um, 10 out of 10 would 100% buy again. Hey, that's gonna do it for us today, guys. Once again, thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for subscribing. If you haven't, please do. It would mean the world to me. And as always, my friends, take it easy.